Alright, so now let us continue. Alright, so... Oh wait, oh damn it, I forgot. There we go. Oh. What's going on here? I thought the Wind Tribe was neutral. Oh ho, the human mind is weak and malleable. Things change. Oops. Setsuna, have you shrunk about oh, a foot or so in the last minutes? No, I'm actually sinking in some quicksand. Mm. Mm. Quicksand at this latitude? How fascinating. Am I going to die now? Physically, yes. Probably. But your spirit will live on in our memories. Azama, why aren't you doing anything to help her? And Setsuna, why are you so calm? Is this some sort of joke? Uh, I guess I'll have to save you. Ah, uh, thank you, my lady. My, my lady, he knows the hero. <sighs> Azama, we are currently under attack. Can you try to be serious for two seconds? Of course, my lady. Although I am currently without any battle elements, so I'm afraid I'm at the mercy of your protection. I think I'm stuck in the quicksand again. Gods, I knew I couldn't rely on the two of you, but this is worse than I imagined. Just try and hold it together long enough for us to see this through, alright? Maybe Ryoma and Takumi can help me babysit once we finally catch up to them. Alright. So yeah, alright. Uh, uh, we'll, we'll talk about these guys once we get them, so... Mm -hmm. So Sakura, um, I do want to like map these guys out because this, yeah, that, this guy has 14 damage to Sakura mm -hmm. and she has... Was, so. Luckily, most of these enemies, like this guy, is stationary, so you don't have to really worry about them. Um, oh god, oh, okay, this might actually be. Might have to pop that dragon down on the next one. Uh, oh, nice, okay, so if I actually Ooh. move um, you here, and then Subaki with his sword catcher. Yep, that's just, yep, that does it. There we go, nice. Nice. And then I can actually dance for you, and then I can use you. Oh, that's. Oh, okay, the Pratt's is that. Ooh! If we devil with that, then that gets a kill. As long as uh, Subaki hits. Okay, nice. Ow. Alright, and now I think we're fine because, yeah, that guy can't reach us, so if I do this. This should allow you to move through the quicksand more quickly. Or I mean the uh, the plane. And like I yep, still can't reach plane. Right. And now Silas can actually move over here and unfortunately he's not doing so well. So I think if I pair him up with Kaze, this will give him the speed to Okay, if I, I think I'll just stay here with the uh, killing edge actually. And Orochi, how does she do? Uh, oh my god, Ooh. she doubles something? <laughs> She doubles something. Oh my god. Zaizo, help her out here. There you go, poor spirit. Damn. Orochi doubling something? Oh my god. That's, that's like asking Lord to burn, actually. <laughs> like, oh wow. Okay, she gets a lot of experience. And. Oh, Jacob can actually heal you up. Alright. Alright, let's see how this turn goes. Hopefully, well. Okay, he goes for Silas. Okay. I guess he can do more damage. Alright, let's see. Okay, he goes for Sakura. God damn it. Dodge. Nope. Okay. Oh, wait, what? This is a route map? Oh my god, you gotta be kidding mm -hmm. me. Oh my god. Why is this around? This should just be kill boss, man. Alright, let's talk. Inoka, what are you doing here? I could ask you the same question, Crystal. Yes, well, a lot has happened. I thought you were in the capital. Yes, I was. But I decided to try and catch up to Ryoma and Takumi on their way to Izumo. Ah, well, it's good that we met up, but I have some bad news. Ryoma and Takumi are missing. We're trying to track them down. Missing? Oh, gods. They are not the sort of men that simply go missing. What has happened to them, Crystal? We don't know. And we've run into a few problems of our own along the way. 
Yes, I can see that. I thought the Wind Tribe was neutral. Why are we fighting? It's a long story, but I believe that we'll be able to explain ourselves to the Chief. Will you join us? We could certainly use a little help. Of course. Although, a little help is about all you'll get from these two. What do you mean by that? Never mind. I'm just happy to have you all on our side. Let's do this. Alright, so let me uh, just pause this, change the music, and we'll go to the gold rates. Alright everyone, so we are back. We're going to hop on over to the growth rates now. So we just got um, we just got um, Hinoka, Setsuna, and um, Azama. So we'll let's uh, hop let's take a look at Azama. So Azama is uh, if I can find him, who is oh actually no he and yeah, we'll do Azama first actually. So uh, yeah, Azama is um, uh, the first um Stats. So Azama is the first uh, monk you get, but technically the second. If you, I mean, if you want to actually count the Shrem as a monk, but he's the like the first monk you get. Um, Azama is um, he's the second hero. Um, the problem that I have with him is that I feel like that he's basically soccer with more strength, less magic, and more like balanced mm -hmm. out growth rates. But and he doesn't have like holy like, blood basically. I think that he's an okay, like, backup healer, but as far as, like, stats go, like, I find that Sakura just turns out better than him than most of my characters. Um, his, he comes mm -hmm. with Miracle as well, and he has, um, Divine Retribution, where basically, if he doesn't have a weapon equipped, um, adjacent, uh, foes, like, basically, um, any damage he takes, he'll, like, deal, like, half, this is kind of like a pseudo-counter in a way, it's like a discount mm -hmm. counter. Um, he comes with D-Rank saves, which, I mean, Sakura, you know, when you get her, she has D-Rank, so if you don't have... If you haven't been training Sakura, or Sakura died somehow in the last chapter... Somehow. <laughs> then, yeah, Azama's good for you, but honestly, I just don't think Azama's all that good. I've tried using him as Sakura, and most of the time, Sakura just turns out way better than him. Mm -hmm. Regardless, like, the only thing that he has over Sakura is that he can become a... He can become a, a Great Master, where the Great Master basically wields, um, the Great Master basically just, is just, um, my, um, uh, a, he wields lances and saves, as opposed to the Shrine Maiden, or the Priestess, which means Sakura from us to, which can wield bows and saves, whereas Sakura basically gets the Shining Bow as a magic weapon, and Azama can wield the Bolt Line and all, but overall, again, I just think Sakura's better, so I'll rate Azama 2 out of 5 stars, because he's just not good in my opinion. I just find that Sakura is just a way better unit, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, I agree. I I have tried to use Azama, and he just never turns out well. Um, he is, like, with his stats, he's more combat-oriented, but he's a healer. And that, you know, 30% magic growth is not helping him. Um, I want my healers to be able to heal me, mm -hmm. you know? Um, and he just, I don't know, I, some people like rave about him, I don't see it. I'm gonna give him a 2 out of 5. Okay. I mean, at least he can build the Sun Festival, so at least he mm -hmm. can be pretty good. And if you need a filler yeah. unit, like, yeah, he, mm -hmm. yeah, you can't go wrong with a filler unit. Alright, next up, let's move on over to Setsuna. Oh god, I, have, I don't really know how this is here, so... Mm -hmm. Setsuna is the first archer you get, so you get a good, so you get a bow use at the start, but oh my god, I mean, okay, so Setsuna, one thing she has going for her is that she's very fast, but the thing mm -hmm. is though, I, like, her 35% strength growth, and her other growth rates aren't that more impressive, like, she has 45% skill and 40% res, which is okay, but she's fast, like, 75, she's going to cap her speed, regardless, um, but the thing is though, she... The problem with bow use is that they get outclassed by uh, Takumi, and Takumi joins you, I believe, in two chapters from now, so... And the thing is, though, that he comes with better base stats as soon as you get him, so why would you train Setsuna in my opinion? Um, Setsuna, she comes with base, with opportunist, which, if she's healed but by a staff, she will recover 150% uh, more HP. Which is really good, because if you have a hero that's only using, like, Bloom Festivals or basic heal stabs, She's going to recover a lot of her HP. The problem is she has a 40% HP growth, so uh, yeah, this really, kind of, the skill is also kind of useless because 
most of the time she's either going to die in one hit with her five defensive res and also it just feels like that the little HP pool that she starts with just seems unnecessary so and again you get talking me in two chapters for now so I don't know why you train her uh, yeah two stars for me again mm-hmm. I I used to be I used to have the exact same opinion about Setsuna. I was like, damn, like, her strength is ass, all she has is speed, her res is, like, okay. Um, and then I trained her up, (laughs) and, uh, she has never disappointed me. Um, Takumi can have some trouble doubling, um, in my experience. Anyway, let me, let me see, um... Yeah, so she's got 75% speed growth. She always turns into a speed demon for me. Um, and she's always just been really fucking good for me, and I don't know why. Um, I do wish she had more strength. That would be great, because that's what Takumi has. It's it's kind of like a preference situation. You have a, an archer that has more strength and skill versus an archer that has more speed and res. Um, I, I've used both and been happy with both. Um, I'm gonna give her a 3 out of 5 because I wish her strength growth was just a little bit higher. Mm-hmm. Like, I think if she traded, like, some resin or skill and put it into strength, I think she'd honestly, like, mm-hmm. be able to, like, give, give, like, Takumi, like, some competition. But the problem mm-hmm. is that's the, that's the problem. She can't give Takumi competition. Because, like, Takumi just has the Fujinumi and better growth as well. I'll have to send you a picture of my Setsuna okay. from my last playthrough. Just like with my Ringa and my Orochi. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to see how your Orochi turns out. So, right. now we can actually talk about a good Pegasus Knight, and oh god, this, like, like, so you had Tsubaki, and Tsubaki, like, this is just like, like, what the hell. Now, here comes Inoka, and she has way better base stats than, mm-hmm. than Tsubaki. Now, to be fair, she's level 8, and um, Hinoka, um, funny enough, she was actually the first person I married in my, uh, very first playthrough of birth. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and, uh, when I found out what happened, uh, how, like, how did that work, uh, yeah, I, uh, lost my shit. Uh, anyway, um, Hinoka is honestly, like, yeah, she's just better than Tsubaki and everything. Like, her growth rates are, like, they're slightly, like, some of them are slightly, like, lower. Like, she has, like, 10% less HP growth than Tsubaki, 5% less magic, um, 10% less... Skill. Um, other than that, 55% strength, 60% speed, 60% luck, 35% defense, 60% rise. Like, she has two, three growth rates that are 60, and her strength and skill are just, like, above 50, or at 50. Like, mm-hmm. in it, and she has holy blood, she, her personal skill is rally cry, which is basically the opposite of Sakura's skill, which instead of it minus two damage, all your allies will deal plus two damage. So, if you don't even want to use her, she's a really good support unit. She comes to C rank and lances compared to Tsubaki, who started with D rank. She has a better personal skill than Tsubaki, better lance rank that starts out with. And she goes with the Gardener you know. Now this is what you, that you should, um, uh, if you have the chance and you want to get um, Azura to C rank and lances so she can roll that, please do, because this is honestly a really good lance. Like, it gives you minus 10 avoid and it only has 5 minus 75 hit. But the 5 defensive res, oh god, this is so useful on Armor Knights, and just like, anyone can make good use of this, like, just from Hinoka winning it, she has 20 base res at level 8 as a Sky Knight, and 40 defense. Um, yeah, I really like Hinoka, and she, with her Holy Blood, like, I have to rate her 4 out of 5 stars, because she's just a better hero than Tsubaki in every way. I think I rated Tsubaki 2 or 3 stars, but Hinoka, she has to get 4 stars. If she had, like, 70 bear, um, base stats or 70 bear growth rates, I'd give her 5, but I think with her growth rates and starting base stats and just everything around her at this moment, I think she's worthy of a 4. Yeah, Hinoka is a menace. Like, you train her up, you are not going to be disappointed. Um, she is pretty much everything you want in a Pegasus Knight and more. So she's got that high speed, the high luck, the high res, and the high skill. But she also has, like, good strength. You know, like, a lot of the times we see Pegasus Knights and they have, like, 40% strength growths, like Tsubaki. Yeah. Um, 
but she's got 55, which is really good for a Sky Knight. Um, yeah, no, she she always turns out absolutely fantastic whenever I use her. She has flight, <laughs> which is pretty nice. Um, like you said, comes with C rank and lances, so she can already use a killer lance and a uh, dual naginata. Um, I I think I'm actually going to give her five out of five stars. She oh. is amazing. Okay. All right. So um, we have, I do believe, we get one more unit at the end of this chapter, but that's at the end. Mm -hmm. So let me just pop this up, put this here, and now we can actually get back to the game. So all right. So I do think Hinoka, yeah, as you can see, like right off the bat, these guys can like do like no damage to her. So let's see, Setsuna. Oh, uh, okay, gives her two strength, two skill, two speed, and oh my god, that's still not enough. All right, uh, Zama, I do want him to heal up Sakura. And I think Subaki. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Wait, what? Alright, Sakura and Azama can't fight. Okay. Um, how does Rinka do. Okay, nope. Uh, damn, this is sucks. Like, Rinka. Oh, like, I really wish you started with the Rinka. Mm hmm. Because she can only use the brass and club and radar. And she's. Okay, she's almost there at the. Oh, nice. Okay, that's what they give Silas enough speed to double this archer. Okay, and Orochi, how does she do? Oh my god, damn! <laughs> I don't know if it's Saizo or the Horse Spirit or both. I think it's just that, like, I mean, how much speed does she have right now? I think it's like four. She. She has like very workable base speed. I know that it's she... just that her growth doesn't. Oh my! What the? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I do know that she did. She did get plus two speed from promoting to witch. So, yeah, you have to keep that. She also um she has her birthday bonus. Right. Um. But the weird thing is, though, she didn't get that from um from she didn't get that though from her birthday. She got the, um that from. Oh, did she actually? Oh, okay. I guess. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I guess it was speed. Okay. Alright, so... Okay, um... Okay, these guys won't reach if I put Tsubaki there, so what I'll do is I'll put him here, and I'll actually give him Setsuna, and she, Hinoka already doesn't take any damage, so she should be fine here. Alright, let's see how this turn goes. Uh, okay, yep. Oh man, if they crit, they would be able to kill this guy. Okay, that guy's coming around. Alright, luckily you're here to take care of him. Okay, I say that as you- What the hell? Oh, okay, 11 defense. I don't know why his defense was that high. Um, if I give- Okay, so that's- Okay, so you should double him and- Oh my god, damn. Okay, this guy's tough to kill. I think I'll just leave you behind here with his on as backup. And... Inoka, just kill this guy. There we go. And all right, so Azura go over here. I do want, I do want Rinka to get this kill. So all right, this turn should be fine. Um, oh my god, man, this guy's gonna be, this guy's gonna take a while. Okay, nice, you dodge. Oh, nice, Dragon Fang. Oh, this, nice. This is why I make sure you guys get Dragon Fang. Oh my god, that's a kill. <laughs> We're gonna see a lot of this. <laughs> yeah, because, like, how much skill do you have already? I think it's, like, pretty high. Oh, okay, about one damage. Yeah. Alright, see, like, it's really nice to have Rinka and Orochi nice. in the attack formation. Okay, nice. Uh, if as long as Rinka hits one of these, she will be able to kill him. Yep, and nice. thank you, Orochi. Do they have a support? I forget. Uh... I... Oh, they do. Okay, yep. nice. Yeah. See, that's where the seal res comes in handy. She can tank something, and then Orochi can just yeah, clean I, up. I think that's actually intentional, because it doesn't make mm -hmm. much sense for Rinka to get have seal res at this point. Yeah. Because, okay. like, think, you you throw your armor knight out there, and, like, you got the mage right behind him. Yeah, okay. And let's see, if I... Okay, uh, nope, alright. 
and I think I have a actually I think I have a um, a Kodachi or like a one two range sword in the convoy. Oh. Uh, let me see. Uh. Um, I have the eleventh sword and oh the oh okay that's B. Yeah, I have, I have twenty skill. <laughs> Damn. Oh oh wait, I was looking at your speed. Damn. Okay. Yeah, I got twenty skill. Twenty base skill. Like that's not even like Hana helping you out. Mm -hmm. There's no bonuses. Yeah, oh my god, I can only imagine what Kaze's bonus is going to give you. Mm hmm And, oh my god, damn. We love to see it. Oh my god, what? Oh my god! Guys, calm down. <laughs> Seriously, I want the other game to get experience here. Alright, I wrote she's first she said, as a witch. Oh. <laughs> Skill? What? Speed? I can... How did she not get magic? She has a 90% magic book, and she has, like, what? How do you not level speed as a witch? Now she got shadow gifts, so now she can build mouse frogs. But how did she not get magic and speed? I don't know. That is crazy. Oh, what? The I missed the net. Oh, my God. What is going on? <laughs> okay, God. so. Okay, that was, uh. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm not activating- I'm not activating this yet, because I know that's gonna cause the interest. Mm -hmm. Alright, let me switch over to size though, okay. and... Okay, nice, thanks, Alright, let's see. And... Oh, wait, uh, do I have a... Okay, Kaz Kaze has to do it. Oh, uh, sure, okay. Oh, okay. So, you've made it this far. You must be Chief Fuga. Please, allow me to explain. No, you must earn the right to explain. Show me that you fight with honor. Okay? I thanks for that, bro. Alright, well, if you want honor, I'll, I'll, <laughs> I'll show you what I can do. Please block Dragon Fang, please. I think one Dragon Fang will... Nope? Okay. Okay, fine. Uh... Actually, do I have any, um, one, two inch lances that I can. Uh, Bold Naginata. Oh, the Bold Naginata? Oh my god, this is so mm -hmm. good for her. And I think I'll just give her the Kill Lance. Uh, yep. Oh my god, damn. Even with, um, like, yeah, like, even without the Guard Naginata, she still, like, is able to take a hit from it. I mean, to be fair, it's a brass unit. And, um, okay, well, I'm just going to hang back, I guess. Um, yeah, I'm not activating that dragon thing, because I know it's going to, like, be a lot of the enemies. Move. Please dodge, Kaze. Thank you. Hey! There we go. I think that other guy is in range. Oh, no, he's not. Okay. Okay, these guys move. Okay, uh... Those guys are weird. I, I remember specifically that those guys, you have to, like... I think you have to be in both of their ranges. Okay, so... Well, let's see. Uh, okay, this guy moves. We'll see. I could be remembering wrong. Uh... No, okay. Uh, let's see now, actually. So, I'm in both of their ranges, so let's see if they actually do attack. It's either that or you have to attack them first, and then they move. Alright, well, if, they, if I have to attack them, then I'll activate the, uh, Dragon Fang next. But, because it'll turn the, uh, oh, oh, nice. Hey! And, okay, yep, now they attack me. Uh, please, oh, uh, oh, I should be fine. Yeah, okay, so you have to be in both of their ranges to attack. Mm-hmm. That's my. Oh no! Oh no! Okay, she used the sunflower. Okay. So um. Okay, so these guys do move. Okay. So all right, let's. Okay. Oh wait, let me activate the dragon thing. Uh, no, actually. 
There we go. And let's see. Oh, okay. That just made the area larger, actually. Um, okay. Um, oh, that, all right. Well, I won't have to worry about taking a hit from the mage. So if I use the bar shuriken, I will kill him. Don't crit, Kaze. Please. Thank you. Because I want to get as many shield gauges as possible. And that actually hit me. Okay. And Saizo, um, with the Kha'Zix now, that'll give plus two speed to everyone here. There we go, nice. And Tsubaki, how does he get help? Um... Oh, nice, okay, with the bolt line, I'll be able to actually double this guy. And... that's... almost a level for Hinoka. And... How does Rinka do? Okay, uh... Okay, I'm gonna swap on this and I'm going to use the Brass Pump just to avoid the crit. Okay, and Alright, nice. And almost along with the Rinka. And I think actually I'm going to... Damn, okay. Okay, actually, I think, um, let me see, so, I think Jacob can take a hit from, uh, from that Samurai slash Archer. 15 speed, okay, yeah, he won't be done, so, if I go here with the Yato, hopefully you can dodge, I uh, hope, hopefully, from Dragon Fang, dodge, damn it, oh, and now you can, okay, thank you, thank you. I do my best, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> See how this goes. Uh, oh god. Okay, um, thank god for the shield gauge. Thank you, Hana. He made herself useful. Oh, uh, watch out. Okay, a little bit worried. Oh, okay, that guy didn't move. Okay, nice. Because I pretty, yeah, this guy would have killed you. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Alright, so, alright, so I just have to worry about these guys and food again. Awesome. So, uh, alright, so if I go here, I'll be able to rally up and speed and cause it, and size will be able to do the kill. Block, thank you, Orochi. And level up for Saizo, first one. So he's now level 8. Hit points, magic skill, speed, nice! <laughs> rally speed for everyone, and let's see, so. Uh, okay. Do I do more damage? Nope. Okay. Um, what if I use Kaze? Um, okay, if I get a crit, I'll be able to kill the Samurai. Uh, nope, no crit. Alright. Well, I can finish this guy off. As long as she hits. Please hit. Don't miss. Please, Rinka. Thank you. Alright, level up for Hey! And she's level 8. Hit point, strength, skill, speed, defense. Nice. Nice. Can't complain about this. And now her uh, personal skill has propped. Yeah, because you got that hit point. Mm-hmm. Okay, this one. Uh, I think Hinoka... Uh, okay, maybe Crystal can help out here. But, oh, God, I got to heal her, actually. Alright, yeah, so maybe I can get a dragon fang here, please. Nope. Dodge maybe? Oh my fucking hell. <laughs> damn it. Wow, damn, you're getting like no experience. It's cause I'm level ten or eleven, oh, right? Yeah, yeah. Alright, and oh I'm not gonna be able to actually kill this guy. Um let me see, sixteen plus no. Uh I get a crit, but I don't want to bank on this. Um, Subaki, how does he do if he attacks from range? Uh, that's a kill. Oof. Setsuna? Okay, so if that hits, that's. She'll 
bring him down to 16, and I think Hinoka with Crystal can get a kill. Okay. Setsuna, please. We got a hit on the 77, though. Please, Setsuna. Thank you. There we go. And then Hinoka with the bold, uh, I can, uh, with Crystal can finish him off. There we go. Very nice. So we're almost done with this map. All right, level for Hinoka, first one. Hit points, skill, speed, defense, res. Nice. Cool. Oh wait, there's still the hero. Okay, actually, Sizer, I think. Uh, uh, actually, let's do this one, Oh my yeah. god. There we go. Dead and Festival. Thank you. All right, so let's see. We have a samurai and a mage. So I think I'll just have Orochi take on the mage, and I'll have Crystal take on the samurai. Actually, wait. Hinoka take on the samurai because you're level ten. She's level 9. <laughs> I know, but actually... Uh, oh, wait, I should get the silence this kill. Um, I don't think you'll kill the samurai. Uh, actually, I'll just move to that. Okay, I'll just Oh, you don't want to top her off. You, you don't want to top oh, Rinka oh, off. Damn it. Oh, fiery blood, damn it. I forgot. Okay, well, uh... Damn. <laughs> damn, oh my god. I am really wondering how good a rush she's gonna be in this game. She's gonna be great. Oh my, she's doubling the samurai. Oh, okay, well done with the horse, you see. But, I'm gonna get rid of her the disturbing gale, and I'm gonna give her the Nosferatu time. Yeah. I mean, she can't double with it, it's still. Right, nice, that's another thing right down. And that's a little for Orochi, so he's now level 7. Hit points, strength, skill. What the? Strength? No mag- She has a 90% magic room. Why? I, that's the second level she has a- Don't- Don't be a Natasha, Orochi. I swear to God. Oh please, my god. Do not be a Natasha. I will be so upset. There is no- There's no excuse. Like, Natasha had a 50% magic room. Orochi has not. There's no excuse. Please. How the hell does she get strength? Seriously, strength is like ten percent. As a witch. Okay. Uh, okay. I'm not gonna attack with uh, Rinka. Plus, we're gonna win. Um. Actually, this might be a prime opportunity to get Silas to kill here. Let's see, he'll attack with the mace. Uh. I'll just wait. Yeah. Not gonna risk it. Alright, so let's see how he'll attack with the mace here. Okay, nice, one damage. You've shown some fortitude. Now show me that you're worthy of my attention. Okay? Nice dodge. Oh, damn, he steals your strength. God damn it. Three strength. Oh, okay, you're not doing anything. Oof! Uh, that one percent crit. If Kaze dies, you're down a husband, Crystal. Right. I was gonna say <laughs> I'm gonna be down a husband, bro. Then we'll have to, to figure something to put. Hinata, is your then? What? Is your Why the freeze? Uh, it lowers his avoidance. Oh. Okay. <laughs> He, he actually has to hit. Uh, okay, nice. Need to hit. Alright, and um, Orochi. Okay, I don't want to give Orochi this kill. Um, okay, dang, I don't know why her crit rate's so high. And thank you, Sizo, for the block. Uh, uh, 14. Yeah, I don't know why it would prove so high. Alright, and I'm gonna get silence this guy. Maybe we can this off with the crits. What? Alright, oh, vantage. But the block and crit kill. 
Thanks. Nice. Thanks. Quite impressive. And nice. Okay, that's nearly a full level for Silas. It points magic skill res. What the fuck? I feel like I'm going what are to these ninth. levels? Okay. 13 turns. Silas on Orochi. Nice. <laughs> well done. I suppose I shouldn't, I shouldn't have underestimated one who carries the sacred Yato blade. No, I will gladly hear your explanation for the unprovoked attack of my people. Yes, of course. Wait, what do you know of my blade? Ah, King Sumeragi and I were good friends. I learned much about the history of that weapon from him. I also showed, cons I also showed concern for its future, which is why it was necessary for me to test you. Test me? How so? Crystal, the blade you possess has the power to link the seal of flames. In the wrong hands, it could unleash enough power to end the world. That's why I want to see for myself if you are indeed the right person to handle it. I see. And what of the villagers we wounded? I already knew that you and your associates were acting in good faith. For what reason would Hoshi and Royalty attack a stranger? Then, and then allow her party to pe be peacefully captured by the stranger's tribe. No, I was well aware that the city was well, thank you for believing in us. This is the first good news we've had in some time, I'm afraid. Oh, please, I would gladly hear your full story. But let us freshen up from the battle and sit down to a proper meal first. I appreciate the invitation, and believe me, a bit of rest and a meal are what we need. But we're in search of Lord Ryoma and Lord Takumi. We haven't a moment to spare. I see. Then you must be on your way. Best of luck. Well, I suppose that worked out better than it could have. Yes, I'm good. I'm glad to know we can still count the wind, the wind tribe among our friends. I'm still puzzling a bit over what Fuga said about my blade. Do you know anything about the seal of flames? No, but I found it curious that he described linking the seal. Could there be more than one seal of flames? If so, could there be more than one sacred blade out there? It is a troubling idea. What if our enemies already possess a similar weapon? Right, that is a troubling thought. But let's focus on the problems in front of us before inventing new ones. You're right, Crystal. I suppose I'm getting carried away. Perhaps we've spoken too soon. Here comes Chief Fuga, and he appears to be in a hurry. Crystal, please wait a moment. How can we help you, Chief? Is everything okay? Yes, yes, thank you. It occurred to me that we might be able to make a mutual beneficial arrangement. You are in need of all the men and women you can get, and we have a skilled diviner who could use some real-world experience. His name is Hayato, and he would like to offer his services to your party. Good day. Um... Is there a problem? Please, don't judge him by his useful appearance. Hayato has mastered a number of unique skills to make him invaluable. I don't mean to sound conceit, but you would be lucky to have me on your team. Very well. I certainly won't turn down your assistance at a time like this. Splendid. I hope you make a valuable addition to your team. And as for you, Hayato, I'm, gl I'm glad to finally be able to offer you this chest of travel. Travel? I hope you both realize that this isn't exactly a vacation. Of course, it's just that Hayato has not had much experience with much opportunity to leave the village. In addition to helping you, he will be exploring the world for the first time. I see. I think I understand exactly how he feels. After all, I spent most of my childhood locked in a Norian castle. Well, then I'm sure you two will have a lot to talk about. And I trust you'll take good care of, of our Hayato. Chief, must I remind you that I am no longer a child? You're right, you're right. I must admit that I still feel a bit protective at times. Dad, I mean, Chief. Lady Crystal, he's not my dad. He should look after me since I was a child. It's okay, I understand. Anyway, we should get going. Welcome aboard, Hayato. And thank you for everything, Chief Fuga. No need to thank me. Please feel free to come back here anytime you'd like. I'm proud to have met the one whom the sacred Yato chose. We shall meet again. We don't actually. Not until revelations. Nope. Alright, so let's take a look at Hayato. Alright, so... Oh yeah, let's see if we have anything. Let's see, Sakura, um... As Asugi's confect, all right. So I hmm. do believe that's a, like a something that's like a bit of a, um, uh, a stat booster, but also heals. Ah, uh, yeah, plus ten HP and grants plus two strength skill speed for one battle. 
and all right, so we do have support. So let's take a look oh, at Hayato. So yeah, Hayato, he's the second diviner you get after Orochi, and he's level one. So you may be asking, why is Hayato like worth like what does he bring? Well, um, in comparison, he actually has a good speed growth uh, compared to um, uh, Orochi at sixty percent. Um, he has uh, slightly less magic than Orochi at fifty-five. Um, he's very balanced with 65 luck, 40% defense, and 30% res, 40% skill, 2, and 50% HP. I do believe Hayato is a... If I do this, let me just bring up this stats. I do think at level 1, he's a bit hard to, like, train in the state. Especially when Orochi has, like, you know... She's a... I mean, we've clashed through her witch, and she has 15 magic compared to Hayato, who has... Base 4, plus 6, with the ma plus 2 uh, magic suit. He does come with um, pride, where if a you basically he wants to be, he'll do more damage to a foe that's at basically the same level as him, or is a, at a higher level. So um, basically, he's um, gonna deal plus four damage to all the enemies um, that he's about to face, because all of them are higher level than him at this point. Um, usually, what I like to do with high is I like to give him the Paragon Manual because he's level one and he'll get double the experience at this rate. Um, he comes with D-Rank and Tomes the same as Orochi, and, um, in, I usually train it, like to train him in, um, uh, Revelations, because Orochi, he get, he get, actually comes first, he, he, he joins you first, and then Orochi joins you second. Here in Birthright it's reverse, and I do like training Haizo in this, in Birthright, because I kind of feel like he's almost like an S in a way, especially because he comes in at level 1. And plus, I don't think anyone else is a better use for the Paragon Manual, like, not even the kids, and like I'm, like compared to everyone else who joins you after this, like you get like over Hinata, which are around your same level. You get um, Kagura, who's roughly around the same level. Like there's no one else who I think who could join you in the first generation who I think makes better use of the character. So I do think Hyde is a good unit. I do think he definitely does need some work to get going because after all, he's level one, and he comes with the rank comes and he joins you after Orochi with. Kind of mediocre base stats, but again, you have to excuse him because he is level 1. So, I think I will give him 3 stars because I do think he can be a good diviner and turn out to basically be a, a well-rounded unit compared to Orochi who focuses on basically just magic and not much else. So, yeah, that's all I have to say about Hayato. I'm not really a big fan of Hayato. Okay. Um... I understand why you call him an S, but I don't think it's late enough in the game to consider him an S, and he doesn't have, like, cracked growth rates. Yeah. Like, if he's if he's gonna join at level 1, where all, when all my units are almost level 10, like, he's gotta have something that makes me want to use him. And I don't like him as a character, so it doesn't help that he's level 1 as well. Um, yeah, I send him straight to the bench. Uh. Every time, my Orochi always turns out better. I I'm I'm weird where with physical characters, I value more uh, skill and speed than uh, strength, like with Kaze, but and like how I like Pegasus Knights a lot. But with magic units, for me, I'm like the opposite. I want them to have a ton of fucking magic because I have so many physical units that I want someone that can hit like a nuke. Um, so yeah, I, he's just not really my guy. <laughs> I'm gonna give him a two, because I know if you train him up, like you said, he can be a pretty well-balanced unit. It's just a pain in the ass, man. Yeah, oh no, I'm not, like, yeah, trust me, like, I can understand training him as a pain. Like, he already has, like, four base matches, like, with, without, mm -hmm. a, without a skill, it's four, with it, it's six. So, I can definitely understand mm -hmm. training him as a pain. Okay, so I do think we're going to do the Mozu prologue. Um, what, okay. do you, what do you want to build? Actually? Ooh. I have no idea. <laughs> you want me to do this one? Sure. Alright, we're going to build the accessory shop. Come on, who needs an armory? Cool. And there's actually something really cool about the accessory shop. And we'll build the Hoshi and Glade and we'll just put it right here. So, one thing I actually do like about the accessory shop, and something that is really cool, is that if you have saved data from... Uh... Okay, thank you for the free bath towel, I wish I could have gotten something else. If you have saved data from Awakening, and you actually, um, uh... 
did like this thing before you started a, a, a game, you get the Awakening Sheep as gift, which you get the Emblem Shoot, basically. So I do, th and uh, yeah, basically we'll just give, uh, uh, see, actually we'll give that to, um, uh, give this to Saizo. And, you know, we'll also give him the bat top, why not? Oh my god. It's nice that the service shut down, because otherwise I think some of our, like, you know, subscribers have actually sent us skips. So, mm -hmm. um, alright, so, um, I do believe this is gonna, now we're gonna be able to start to start benching units. Um, um, hmm. oh wait, actually, I know what we can do. I do have a Hayato here that I can actually Oh my god. For. I also have a Hana, and like, I have a lot of like, things that we can just buy skins for. But, I do think I am gonna give him that paradigm. Because I do think the, I'm actually gonna that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, see, I, I don't have the DLC, so Paragon just doesn't exist for me. Oh, God. Don't do that. I do think we should give out the staff boost. I don't know if you want to give them out now, because I do know that we're going to be getting um, a Roach, no, uh, Oboro, and a Nanda next. I don't know if you want to give mm -hmm. them the staff boosters now or just save them for later. I would save them for a little bit and see if someone gets screwed in something, you know? Okay, I mean, Orochi didn't get a match at all, but she's still killing everything. Alright, um, we have the invasion. Ooh. I think we're gonna hold- I think what we'll do is that next time we'll do chapter 9 and then we'll do the invasion. Mm -hmm. But for now, okay. we'll, we'll do the prologue, so let me just make a cut here. Mm-hmm.